And welcome back, everybody. Oh, an alt tabbing. Back to Fire and Shadow. Now with the family reunion. Well, I guess we're just doing Shadow now. Uh, shaken by the bloodshed, Chaitin seeks to reunite with his uncle, an elder of the Lakota. Yeah, this is all totally different. I got word through a Lakota trader at the fort that my uncle and his band were camped in the hills. No more than a day's ride away. So, with some trepidation, I went to see him and introduced myself. That's cool. Nephew. <laughs> nephew is just nephew. Frank, if you'd like. You have an English name? This name was given to me by the Christians when they first visited us. I didn't care for them all that much. But I kind of liked the way Frank Warbonnet sounded. <laughs> it does have a nice ring to it, Uncle. It is good you have come. When your father passed, we were saddened that you were taken so far away. However, I'm happy to see my nephew has turned out to be a strong warrior, like his father. Thank you. We have beaten the gang that was attacking Lakota villages and Falcon Company property. This is good, nephew. But what is your concern with this Falcon Company? It's my job to protect it, uncle. Since I was wounded in war against the South, I had to make my way somehow. My mother offered me a job, so I took it. The company allows our people and other nations to trade and gives honest folk employment so they can feed their families. This might be so, but at what expense? Your mother's company continues to bring white settlers by the train load. They slaughter the bison, attack our people. They do not understand what it means to be in good relations. I'm afraid your mother has lost her way. Your father would be disappointed to hear this news. You may be right about the company, Uncle, but now that these bandits have been taken care of, I can return home and explain your concerns to Mother. Try to make things right. Doksha Ake, Uncle. Yeah, the new cutscenes are so much longer. But to be fair you know, have a lot more nuance to them and whatever. But yeah, I guess Chayton's father is still Lakota. But, and he's dead, like in the uh, the original version. But last time he was, uh, he met up with Amelia. But now he didn't. Uh, with the Falcon Company's railroad upgrade completed, literally, Chayton uh, returned east, yet it was only a matter of time until his return. Gold rush. Been 10 long years since returning to the East Everyone Coast go Mayans. Miami. I had been working from the inside to change the way the Falcon Company treated my people, while at the same time using the company's influence to lobby for change in DC. Good to hear. I met with modest success and would have kept at it until I got word from my contacts in the capital that the US Army was planning a major offensive against the Lakota people. I had to warn my uncle of the coming war. Satan Black. Ha <laughs> ha! Glad to see the company still knows when to send its best. Especially when there's a whole lot of money involved. I've got more than just company business to take care of out here. And it looks like you're moving up in the world, home. You've got a badge now. Ah, Sheriff's just another word for a humble servant of the people. But, enough about me and my illustrious career. Let me show you what we found out here. Gold. And wouldn't you have it, there's another pack of thieves even worse than before, trying to get their grubbing hands on it too. Call themselves the hole in the wall gang. What? We took these care of them already. Expanded and nobody to defend them. It shouldn't be any surprise what we're up against now. Not to mention you've been under attack from the Sioux. Sioux is what our enemies call us. We are Lakota. Ooh, hit a sore spot, huh? 
But anyhow, this here is oh, there we go. That shows the name Indeed change. The company is losing a great deal of money to these outlaws, and it's giving all the gumps back east headaches. Once this gang trouble gets taken care of, it appears you and I have some catching up to do. You know what's bad about gold? It attracts flies. Well, that doesn't Start seem to swatting. fly. The vermin around here want to destroy the mining. Yeah? What you need? Your job is to protect yeah. the Fair mining thing. camps okay. while taking out their barracks. So, do you never fight the Lakota? Oh. The food and wood here are scarce. We'll have to rely on our trading posts. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I remember this one. Food, wood, gold. We can get the resources food, we most need by changing the wood, our trading posts. Gold. And you can leave you as XP. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I remember this. So in the original iteration of this game. Uh, you had to fight off some Lakota? Maybe two different groups? I, I don't remember. As well as, like, random Spanish miners, which I think are still probably over here. Yeah. Okay. Sure thing! Sure thing! Uh, let's get some... Oh, Musketeer. Vitren. Also, why does that... I just realized that the female villager voice acting sounds a lot like Amelia. I'm going now. Yes. Right. Dash agrees. Okay. okay. Allow no mining camp or trading post to be destroyed. I suppose I should ah, deal with yes. that then. I'll do it. Yeah, I thought we already... I thought we already dealt with the hole in the wall, gang. See, Dash is, is equally unhappy. Oh, the Hatless Brigade is back. What is your command? Yes, I'll do it. Uh, One of our trading posts is under attack. Yeah, 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 I'm on it, I'm on it. I'm going now. Right. <laughs> yes. Get him. I'm ready. Yes. Uh, looks like they also have veteran Hussar. I'm ready. I'll do it. I'm going now. But yeah, like, a huge part of the, the original version of this campaign was the fact that you end up fighting the Lakota. Oh, we can only build one town center. How am I supposed to boom? Also, we can't upgrade our outposts? Lame. But yeah, like, a huge part of the campaign was that you are uh, essentially tasked with fighting the Lakota, and then you realize that, um, you know, you're invading their, their own homes and then fighting to kick them out like they don't belong there just for gold and, you know, not like it's a, an especially compelling reason. Um. Right. Wait, what? 
villager settler. Ah, yes. Yeah, I'll do it. Very important distinction. What you need? Um. I'm, I'm going now. Maybe I can start looking to. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Why do I think there's a thing there? Rival miners, yes, the Spanish are over here. What the hell are the Spanish doing here? What is it? I'm going now. These hills are just ugly. Why should they have it all for themselves? I'm ready. Man, these guys are pretty darn well equipped for some banditos. Oh, whoops. Um, got some goons. I wonder what Civ. I guess they're pirates? Barracks. Good work. Okay. What about the stable? Yes. Attack. I'm going now. Maybe it's not hockeyed or something. Yeah, but okay, this is very clearly well after the Civil War. And unless they change it, the last scenario is uh, the Battle of Little Bighorn. Which I think was in the 1870s. So what on earth are the Spanish doing here? <laughs> but honestly, we're just getting a big old army. Nah, it's struggling as much as last time, which is nice. Yeah, the trading posts are giving us just a ton of resources. As one okay. might expect. Alright. Okay. Alright. Yeah, okay. Sure Wait, so yeah, so it's holding the wall gang times too. Um, I think we're still good. Oh, whoops, that is not hot keyed. What is I'll do it? I mean musketeer plus guns. Plus cannons, I guess. It's pretty darn good. It's pretty much the Hal Bonninger of this game. Well, I guess you can actually just go for Hal plus cannon. Um. Hopefully we're in time. Attack. 
Ooh, they had cannons too. Okay, well, at least we killed that. Yeah, it's so weird that we can get Grenadier ship, but we can't actually make them. Or upgrade them. Or get things like arsenals. Oh, uh, well, those guys are pretty much dead. Again, what does this have to do with anything? Attack! I'm ready to battle. Like, where are these guys even coming from? Mexico had gained independence at this point. What is your command? Right. Oh yeah, I forgot about the just the barracks. Okay, now I'm going to be really embarrassed if I don't even know this. Yeah, 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 it was way earlier. I thought it was. Yeah. 1810 to 1821 is when they gained independence. Yeah, like, Spain has no reason to be here. Ooh, five settlers. Gimme, gimme. And that is already in my deck. It's like, Supra! Uh, the threat to the gold mines is finally under control, but what about the threat to the Lakota? Tension. With the hole in the wall gang taken care of, that leaves us with just the native problem. Sounds to me like you got things backwards, Holm. The Black Hills are sacred to the Lakota, and the problem is white folk can't seem to get enough of it. Yeah, with, with this much money on the line, I figure you'd listen to reason, Shaitan. Go to hell, Holm. I'm heading into the hills to see my uncle. Things have changed since you've been what? gone, Shaitan. The Sioux aren't the friendly neighbors they used to be, and there may still be remnants of the gang in those hills. Don't imagine you'll make it more than halfway before you find yourself scalped or killed. The only scalp you need to worry about, old man, is the one on your narrow-minded head. Also, well, isn't it kind of weird? Chayton has like this this huge like affiliation affinity for the Lakota when he spent like. <laughs> Three minutes. <laughs> yeah, so I think in the next scenario, you're uh, you're supposed to get to Maybe Crazy Horse. Was right, could be a tough fight to get to Uncle Frank. Maybe these townsfolk will help us out. Yeah, I think you, I'm pretty sure you had to go find Crazy Horse. No Crazy Horse. I'll do it. What is Maybe Crazy what Horse later. I Uncle Frank. Yes, I'm going now. Um. Okay, so there are some bison to hunt. I'm ready. Yes. Yes. Why do I have this distinction? Yes. Okay, so that's five. I wanted to just put ten on food. That way, I can shift that those ten on food over. To a farm later, and it'd be nice and easy. I'll do it. Uh, but yeah, there's some chests of coin hanging around, or just chests in general. I'm ready. Right. Yes. I'm ready. Right. I'll do it. Right. Yes. I'll do it. Did I already make a market? Or did I just think I was making a market? I probably was just thinking. 
So yeah, I'm pretty sure you have to fight your way through the Lakota to actually get to Crazy Horse. Or that's what you had to do back then. If we find some way to ignite it, we can clear that path. I'm going now. Right. I'm ready. I'm going now. Right. What? I'll do it. I'm going now. Um. Right. What if we just walk this way? But yeah, I'm pretty sure, like, Holm originally doesn't uh, betray. Chaitin until the uh, the end of the scenario. Like, I, I think he, like, Chaitin goes to talk to Crazy Horse, and then Holm shows up and is like, Supra! Then he, like, uh, ambushes them. Yes, I'm ready. I'm going now. But yeah, might as well get, get these free resources while I can. Also, they can't attack me. Am I playing Nietzsche? Oh, uh, that's a lot of gold. But yeah, until they actually blow these up, they can't attack me. So... Um... We're just gonna boom like crazy? What is your command? Command. I'm ready. I'll do it. Yeah, right. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Anyway, that treasure should give us the gold we need. Ready. I'll do it. I guess let's get some hussars. Yes. All right. Oh wait, is this more wood? Yes, I'm going now. Right. I'll take it. Yeah, I really see no reason to blow up one of those uh, entryways until I have a big old economy and army and whatnot. Uncle Frank, man. Yeah, why do I have, like, this memory of, like, home and some, like, miners being up here? And then they, like, walk around the entire map and then they show up over here and ambush you. I seem to remember, I, I remember, like, I had units, like, bugging out. So they were, like, walking across, like, cliffs. Like, this whole map should be, you know, covered in cliffs, regardless of who I'm fighting. But... Like, there's just, like, a little pathway across the entire side of the map, and then they end up just, like, hanging out over here until the ending of that scene. At least that's how it was. Yeah, I, I remember that very specifically, or vividly, or whatever. Yeah. Yep. I'm ready. I'm ready. Right, hit point boost to military units and the gathering rate boost to nearby economic I don't remember the gathering rate bonus. So that's pretty cool. So Lakota start with uh, Max Top. They're like Huns. They are the Huns of this game. Yes, I'm going now. Right. Okay. Uh, um, why you do me like this game? Why do you restrict my town center limit? It's gonna have this huge 3TC boom. It's gonna be great. I'm ready. Right. Also, why am I playing this crappy knockoff British Civ? I'm ready. Okay. I mean, it was kind of the same deal in the the fire campaign. I mean, to be honest, like this campaign and the uh, the fire campaign are my my least favorite. 
of all of AoE3. I'll do it. I'm going now. Because in the Agent Dynasties campaigns, I'm ready. I'm ready. Uh, we'll actually get to like play the full breadth of a given civilization. Yeah, right. I'll do it. All right, we'll just make an army. Bandits. Yes. What you need? Sure thing. Cause it feels like there's nothing for me to like do. I'll do it. I'm going now. Uh I guess let's get that. Okay, that probably opened up a path. I mean, I still could just, like, wait till I'm at 200, 200 pop, but unless I... If I'm not even able to get, like, a good eco behind it, it's just gonna take way too long. Yes, right. I'll it's the hole in the wall, gang! I thought we dealt with these guys already. Get him. Get me some oop rods. A black powder wagon has arrived. I'm Run him into a weapons cache to clear a pass. Attack. What is your command? Yeah, to be honest, this whole plot doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Not that the other ones really made much sense. But this one didn't especially improve the uh <laughs> The logic. Like, what are we even doing? Why are we training an army to fight bandits we've already dealt with? <laughs> like, oh, there might be a few scattered left, but like, no, this is a legit operation. It looks like they've got a whole lot of stuff. Yes, I'm going now. Right. And and we're still spending like the entirety of the Lakota campaign. Uh, up to this point, not playing anything that has to do with Lakota. I'm ready. I'll do it. Yes. I'll do it. I'm ready. Oh, oh, hey, another uh, black powder cart. Anyway, uh, there's obviously several different paths we can take. I naturally do not remember any of them other than the Holman as bandits like walking around the side of the map. Uh, but it looks like those guys are super stuck, so we'll uh, not free them until we can kill them. Yes. What can I do? I'm going now. What is your command? I'm going now. <laughs> I'll do it. Yeah, it's like there's just so few units and stuff we can make. I don't know, maybe you guys think differently. I'm recording these like pretty far in advance just because I want to well I want I want to get them out in a decent time, but even so I'm still like way ahead of schedule just because I want to play the campaigns, right? It's Age of Empires and it's a campaign. It's it's uh and I want to play them, like, for the first time with them being recorded. So, I eh, might as well just record them. If they kill each other, you can do that? Here's more hole in the wall gang. Yep, just a few remnants of them. Not at all this massive frickin' operation. Get some cannon. What is your command? Oh, that's not even garrison. 
I'm ready. Right. But yeah, we can't get stuff like uh, all the arsenal upgrades and whatever. Do they only have pistoleros and renegados? Oh, well, hello there, Dash. Did you pay me a visit? He's a good boy. Always worth being distracted by Dash. Are you checking in on me? Oh, you're so happy. Um, I don't know. Let's get some more Hussars. Why was the second scenario the hardest one? <laughs> like, that one was so much harder than all the other ones. I mean, obviously, knock on wood and all that. Another cart. Use it to clear some of those trees. Just get us close to an enemy building, and we will give our lives for the cause. Yep, just a real tiny little straggler dudes left over. Okay, all right. Yes, attack. I mean, you can really, like, just, but the way the uh, training units and battalions, or batches, or whatever, uh, you can really mass a lot of pop really quick. And end up just spending a ton of resources on military. Oh, whoops. I'm going now. I'm ready. I'll do it. Thought I was missing something. Good to know that the bandits have a church. Good not without a moral compass. And I'm sure that is uh, the the only church, of course, and that is the uh, the Church of Doubt. Oh, there's some cavalry. What can I do? Right, I'll do it. Yep. Sure thing. Yes. I'm ready. Um, I think we're still okay. That seems to be a rather large base. Some grenadiers, why not? What is your yes. command? I'll write. I'm going now. What is your command? I'm ready. Right. As Ornlu struggles to select villagers. Yes. I'm ready. I'm ready. Yes. I'm ready. I'm going yes. Onward and upward. Yes, I'm going now. I'm ready. Okay, can't go that way. Did I seriously just bust my way into a dead end? I'm right. Wow. Yes, I'll do it. Just I'm wow. Down. Yep. Good job, me. Looks like we can go this way. Yes. What is your command? Right. Might be able to click up soon. Get whatever nominal upgrades we might need. I'm ready. I'm right. 
But yeah, we'll see how they do the historical battles. I'll do those after I do all the campaigns. Because there you should actually, like, get some, you know, at least decent historical fiction, right? What is your command? Also, my game's kind of lagging. I'm ready. Right. Yes. I'll do it. Right. Oh yeah, I think it was around here that just like units just like glitched through and just ended up like going all the way over here. Okay, can click up in just a second. Um, do we really need a fort? Yeah, we need a fort. We really need a fort because there's no kill like overkill. Yes, I'm going now. Right. Okay, I'm not going to go that way because I'm pretty sure that just leads to like over here. I'll do it. Right. Do I even have any wagons left? I'm ready. Yes, I do. Yes. I'll do it. Yeah. Oh, okay. I actually have another one over here. All right. What is your command? I'll do it. I'm ready. Right. I'm going now. Oh, right. still looking real good. It's like, why do grenadiers have so many negative multipliers? Against cavalry, against shock infantry, and villagers. Like, why villagers? The yes. units are already mediocre as is. Except for British. British, I think, can get some really good ones. Gotta get to Uncle Frank, man. I'm ready. Right. Yes. Yes. Right. I'm ready. To attack. What you need? Let's bring her all the way up. Yep. All right. What you oh, this is so laggy. I'm sure this is coming through on the YouTube video, which I apologize for, but obviously, I am not in complete command here. Even oh, that's a lot of pistoleros. There's guard musketeer. I'm yes, I'll do it. I'm ready. I'm going now. Yes, I'm ready. Um, let's actually get some guard hussar. Get more muskets. What is I'll do it. I'm I'll do it. Yep. I don't really know when we're gonna be hitting like another roadblock. What is your command? I'm But uh I'm amassing a good amount of powder wagons just in case we need to burst our way through. Horsey guns. Oh, whoops. I'm ready. Yes, attack. I'm ready. I'm going now. Yes, right. Huh? Just jump the cliff. That's all you need to do. That looks like a place we need to blow up. Yeah, like after the first scenario, I thought we'd be in for like a real slog. But or the, uh, the first couple scenarios. Wait, that really? Okay, there we go. I'm 
ready. Yes, I'm going now. Right. I'm ready. I'll do it. Yes. What is your command? Right. I'm going now. Yes, right. Yes, I'm to battle. I'm ready. I'm going now. All right. Boom. Oh wait, we have to actually bring Chayton. Oh, never mind, he's right here. I thought Chayton would probably be like all the way back over here or something silly. I'm going now. I'm ready. Yes. Right. I guess that makes sense. We have to I'm going now. I'll do it. Get to Uncle Frank. I'm going now. I'll do it. I think there's like one more thing we need to blow up. Right. Yep. I'll do it. What you need? Boom town. Yes. Attack. Attack. Hey, what's that bear doing there? Yes. I guess he couldn't bear the violence. Oh wait, no, this is my fort wagon. Sure, let's get a fort. Okay, where's Chayton? Man, Uncle Frank sucks. He has zero siege attack, zero guardian attack. I need to speak to you. I. I. What? 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 Did something go wrong? Oh, but that guy totally clipped through that guy. I am really confused. I. It seems like the, you know, home would uh, attack and all that. But I guess not. Anyway, guys, that is going to be it for today. Next time, we may be finishing the um, campaign or the the fire or the shadow campaign. We might be finishing, maybe not. We'll see you next time. See you guys then.